And wait by the phone, fearful of updates from their loved ones across the world. Tonight, the Augusta community showed up to show support for Israel. They had to bring in extra chairs tonight at the Odessa Yashur and Synagogue on John's Road. And Audrey Dick Herber was there as the community came together for what turned out to be a very somber event. As violence still rips through the Middle East, people in Augusta with many different backgrounds and religious beliefs came together tonight to mourn the lives lost and hope for the future. As they entered the synagogue, they received these flyers that say, I stand with Israel. What happens in the world doesn't just affect one side of the world, it affects us all. People from many different backgrounds came to show support. Being a believer in the gospel of Christ, um, I think as people, you know, we should stand together in unity when there's a major injustice and I think regardless of what your faith is uh, I think any decent person can agree that what we witnessed uh, the past couple of days uh, hasn't been how we should live as humans and for those a part of the Jewish community it's very heartwarming to know that the community is pulling together to help us through this because for many it hits too close to home I am worried sick um, it has been a week of an emotional roller coaster, worrying about what's going on and feeling helpless to be able to do anything. I know a few families that live over there and that's what kind of scares me because you never know when you'll get that call saying this person died or like this person lost their brother or their sister and that's what's so frustrating. So for now, they are doing what they can to help and are calling on the community to do the same. If you have the means, support, you know, whether it's money, clothes, shoes, or just blood, or, you know, educating yourself or a friend on what's happening, because hate on both sides is not helpful to either side, you know. Peace is all that the world needs to move forward, and I feel like that goes for any community. The speakers tonight really emphasize the importance of unity and stress the importance of helping in any way you can. For more information on how to donate, visit WRDW.com. And it does mean a lot to see so many people coming together. And I love her words of peace there at the end. Audrey, live in our newsroom, thanks very much.